My name is Dorothy Oko. I head communications and public affairs for Google in Africa. Here are my top tips for content creation. So what we tell people, even at YouTube, is if you're creating content to make sure you know your audience, who are you creating it for? It's very important. Is it for Gen Z, for millennials, or for everyone? You need to be very sure who your audience is so you're creating audience for them. Next is to always have a specific time when you put out your content. You can't change. Today it's Monday, tomorrow is Wednesday, next day is Friday. No, if it's Monday at 8 o'clock, it has to be Monday at 8 o'clock every week. You have to be consistent. The other thing that helps your readers and your audience connect with you is having a very consistent background. Your audience feels they are part of your family. They need to know that when they come, you are in the same space. So you don't change today, you're in the kitchen, tomorrow you're in the living room, tomorrow you're in the... No, it has to be one same place so that people feel when they come, they're connecting to you from where you left off yesterday. Having that consistency of visuals is really important. And the other thing has to do with length. You have to decide, do people want you know, a one hour thing. You really have to be famous and a celebrity to have one hour, I find. In my experience with No Head Podcast, I found the sweet spot is 30 minutes. When I go over 30, no one really, I lose people and I see that from my analytics, people drop off. So what is important is actually, if you can do it less, and so if you do it less, like I find the people who really know how to do it, um, there's a couple, Ling and Lam, they do it, it's like 15 minutes, amazing. 15 minutes is all you need, or two minutes, or better still, do YouTube shots, 60 seconds, and share your content with people. Thank you.